isn't bravery that drives her. Bravery only means something to those afraid of death. Oh, sweet, we're finally playing Sin with Sacrifice. Shh, I'm trying to watch it. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. What's happening right now? I don't know, because you keep talking. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't really know how this game plays. What, what's the gameplay like? I don't know either, but it's a BAFTA award-winning game. We have to pay attention. It's very important. That log doesn't really look seaworthy. Oh, will you shut up? Okay, just, hey, sorry. just watch. Sorry. Just watch and listen, mm. okay? This is a digital masterpiece. I know because everyone told me, and we have to just deal with it. I mean, we are playing this game. All, all just right. try. All right. Okay, I mean, I understand that from a storytelling perspective, they did, a, like, an amazing job. I just don't know how the game actually plays. That's what I'm just asking. I don't know either. I just know that it's good. So just deal okay. with it. Okay. Sorry, I even asked. It's not too late to get into the boat and go back. The graphics on this are amazing, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, no, the, the graphics are really great. Um, so do I just walk a lot in okay. this game? We haven't even gotten into the game proper. You just have to wait. Focus. Until the game starts. Look closer. I'm look. kind of bored. Of course voice. you're bored. Of course you're bored. She We're playing a BAFTA award-winning game of the year that is critically acclaimed by gamers, by news outlets, and of course you're bored. And your fate lies it's just, you know, I understand all of that, but there's still a personal experience that I have to go through, and right now it feels like mostly what I'm doing is walking places and listening to voices in my head. You do that anyway! In your regular life. Maybe that's why I'm bored right now, because it feels... Oh, well, you just shut up. Okay. Shut up. No, oh, I'm yeah. going to have a great time if you keep telling me to shut up. What? Well, well, you know what? Just shut up, and I won't have to say it anymore. So these stones... Yeah, what about the stones? They just, um... They just talk to me? Do I have to get through that many stones in this game? Am I going to walk to each one of those stones? Well, I don't know. I guess we're going to have to just be quiet and find just out. A, just a that's how this works. Oh, cool, there's combat in this game. Shh, I'm trying to concentrate. Just, just deal with it. Okay, uh, hey, I was just wondering, like, um, why does it take so long to actually, uh, kill these grunt characters? Well, because they're, they're not really grunt characters. I think that they're all supposed to be, like, practically, like, boss characters, you know? And I think that the uh, symbolism here is that it's actually, like, her demons, like she's fighting her inner demons. Oh, God, there's subtext to this. Of course there is. Okay, look. You don't want to play, that's fine. But I'm going to play because I'm a serious reviewer, okay? I'm a serious person who plays games seriously. I like to have fun. Is it possible for me to have fun in the game? No. Okay, I think that we've lost the point of what games are now. Oh no, she's down. What happens now? I, are we, are we are, dead? Okay, do we start over? <sighs> What's going on with her arm? Again. These are plot points. I don't know what happens yet. Why don't you just watch and find out? Although we might actually be... We might actually be dead. I told you. Oh no, someone's sneaking up on us. Who is that? Just stop. Oh wait. Oh wait, it's... Okay, now I'm confused. I think she's uh, she's confronting her own mortality. And uh, she's, she's trying to uh, hold her sanity together. Is this a plot point? Okay, you have to be quiet now so we can play the game. I'm not doing a lot of playing in the game. I think I learned how I do light attacks and heavy attacks, but that's pretty much all the gameplay I've been doing. A lot of it's been walking around right now. Okay, again, we're very early into the game. We need to play longer. All of her suffering will have been for nothing. Did you get her to hit the door? No, that's still the cutscene. Of course it is. So let me get this straight. Like, every time I fail in the game, I get more rot, and that leads me closer to just a, a total game over. Is it, is Uh, I guess. I guess that's what happens. Okay. Um, so what happens if I get completely rotted out or whatever? I think the game is over and you start back at the beginning. Oh, I don't like that at all. I don't like that. I, uh, yeah, I'm not liking that either because it, it seems like I'm going to fail a lot. But you know what? We're going to, we're going to push through and we're going to find out if we can actually complete this game without getting the rot corrupting Sinless Brain. If you say so. Okay, I'm starting to realize that, like, when okay, more than one enemy is on screen at any given time, this becomes, like, nigh on impossible. It takes so much to do. Okay, look, I'm trying to concentrate. I have to remember blocking, and I have to remember how to swipe left and right. You're swiping left and right? This isn't Tinder. A Tinder reference? Really? Okay, well, now she's dead.
Now she's dead. Yeah, because you keep interrupting me. Why are you always like this? You just can never accept when a game is just okay, good. Because I also have to play the game. And if I'm playing the game and I'm not enjoying the game, then why am I playing the game? Because it's a masterpiece of artistic expression. Yeah, but is it for me? What's with the strange Where's Waldo game that I have to play? Why are you so impossible when it comes to this game? Okay, well, besides the arenas where you fight, it seems like the only things I do are line up these shadow graphics with the landscape and run a lot. But these things don't seem to really work that well together. I have to be running a lot, and then I have to stop and pause and look at the environment a lot, and then I have to get out my sword, and I have to hit things, and it's just a really confusing mesh of tones going on in my head. Well, you know, maybe that mimics the fact that she is having bouts of insanity. I really feel like this game would have worked better if it were a movie. Can we just watch the making of? Oh, why are you always like this? I'm not always like this, it's just with certain games. Like, I can appreciate the fact that the game is obviously made well. You know, it was done with a, with a level of artistic expression and care and consideration that you usually don't see from games, but I just don't know if it's for me. You're not even giving this a chance. You're not even giving- I, I am! I am giving this a chance! I am! It's just, I'm having a little bit of a hard time staying engaged with it, that's all. And you know, maybe this game just wasn't meant for me. You know, maybe I can just accept that the game is really good and a lot of people like it, but maybe it's just not for what, me. What, what, what are you talking about? Of course, if it's, if it's a good game, it's a good game for everybody. No, no, that's not true. That's not true. Sometimes a thing can be really good, but some people are just not going to like it. You know, like, everyone keeps trying to tell me that anime is great, but I don't really like anime. You like Pokemon. I don't really know if Pokemon is considered anime. Uh, po po Pokemon's not considered anime. Eh. Pokemon's, well, oh, Pokemon's not anime. What is it? Pokemon, well, but Pokemon is sort of like uh, just a cartoon, but it's in an anime style. Doesn't that just make it anime? Okay. But it's not really... I think that if you talk to people that really love anime, they would have a little bit of a problem with what you're talking about. Oh, why is this so impossible? Just enjoy the game. Just enjoy the game. I'm really trying. I just can't. And now I'm on fire. So I'm really not enjoying that. And oh, the rot's back. And I'm going to lose this game. I just know. And now my progress is gone, and this will be for naught. Why do I keep having to line these symbols up? Oh, this again. It's, it's, it's a just, metaphor, okay? It's a metaphor about her mental state, uh, trying to piece together fragments, I think. Kind of reminds me a little bit of Tetris. <sighs> do, you, do you think maybe she had memories of Tetris? No, no I don't think that. No, shut, shut, okay, oh, okay, shut. okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. Look at all the work that was put into this game. Can you see the amount of work? I, so I do, sorry. and I appreciate that, and I really like it. I do. But again, I'm just speaking from my personal experience, and can you say that anything you're doing right now is particularly enjoyable? Not when you're talking to me like this. No. Okay, fine, I'll shut up. Wait, is Carl Urban in this game? Ha-ha! Okay, so maybe it's not you. Ha-ha! I prove my point. How is it that a narrative-driven game also has this insane combat system? I don't understand. I'm just sitting back uh, Okay, here. second win, second win. Alright, one win, one hit, no, and, just, and no still one died. Me. Great. Oh no, oh, looks like that rock's coming again. back. What you gonna do? Oh boy. Okay, okay, this time, this time I could do it for real. Okay, and get back up. Come on, action surge. All right, yeah, sure you can. and we're at it. Yep. And damn it! Ooh, look at that. Mmm. Oh, would you look at that? Oh, that arm's oh, getting worse. Going what am I gonna do? Okay, if I can just Here keep the two again. of them in front of me at one time, I should be okay. Just There's gotta keep them. them in front of me and told you. Oh. oh. Uh, Never works out. <laughs> yeah, one day you probably just give up. I don't know when, but soon, hopefully. Oh, why am I not enjoying this? Yeah. I'm supposed to be enjoying it. I, 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 I swear, I'm supposed to be enjoying I'm this. I'm just telling you, sometimes a game, it just isn't for everybody, you know? And it, maybe we're just the one person it's not for. Uh, that's okay. You know, we, we're not bad people if, if we don't love the game. You know, it's it still seems like a, a really great title that does something really profound and talks about psychosis and 
mental illness, and, and that's important. And I really hope that things like this keep going in the future because these are important stories to tell that in any other medium doesn't really seem to resonate as well as it can in this where you can actually interact with your character. So what you're saying is that we can just accept the fact that the game is good and it's a good thing that the game exists, but we don't have to enjoy it ourselves, and if we don't, that's okay. I think that's what we're saying. Um, we're still probably gonna get a lot of flack for that, though. No, we're gonna get flack for the Pokemon thing. Hey, if you could be a Pokemon, what would you be? We're not having this discussion again. Okay, okay, so sorry. Sorry, I brought it up. Hit, hit the... Ugh. <laughs> I'm thinking Bulbasaur. <laughs> you okay? Okay, well, if not Bulbasaur, then who? Uh, Charizard. Charizard? Mr. Mime? I don't even know you anymore!